Hello and welcome back to our channel, History Exposed. Today, we delve into the captivating life and reign of Maharaja Ranjit Singh, also known as Shere Punjab, and the first Maharaja of the Sikh Empire. From his early battles to his far-reaching reforms, Maharaja Ranjit Singh left a lasting mark on the history of the Indian subcontinent, so let's jump right in. Before this video starts, like the video and subscribe to our channel, and also watch the video right to the end to find out who Maharaja Ranjit Singh was. Born on November the 13th, 1780 in Gujranwale, Punjab, Ranjit Singh overcame a childhood battle with smallpox that left him blind in one eye. At a young age of 10, he fought his first battle alongside his father. Tragically, after his father's passing, young Ranjit Singh embarked on a series of wars to expel the Afghan invaders, eventually being proclaimed the Maharaja of Punjab at the age of 21. Before Ranjit Singh's ascent, the Punjab region was filled with opposing missiles with 12 under Sikh rule and 1 under Muslim rule. Ranjit Singh managed to unite the Sikh missiles and consolidate his power by defeating external invasions, particularly from Afghanistan. Additionally, he established friendly relations with the British East India Company which played a significant role in the future of the Sikh Empire. Ranjit Singh's reign was marked by reforms, modernization and investments in infrastructure leading to overall prosperity. His visionary leadership extended to his army, the Khalsa, which included Sikhs, Hindus, Muslims and even Europeans. This multicultural force represented the unity that Maharaja Ranjit Singh encouraged within his empire. Under Ranjit Singh's rule, new coins were minted in the name of Guru Nanak and the empire adopted the Nanak Shahi calendar. He created the Sarkar Khalsa and held court at the Darbar Khalsa, implementing policies that respected the diverse religious and cultural backgrounds of his subjects. Despite his significant accomplishments, Maharaj Ranjit Singh's personal life had a share of complexity. He was married multiple times with a total of 20 wives. One marriage in particular caused controversy within the Sikh community, leading to a confrontation with Akal Takht, the highest Sikh religious authority. However, through a show of remorse and forgiveness, Ranjit Singh was forgiven. Ranjit Singh's physical appearance and lack of formal education might have deceived some, but he possessed exceptional military awareness and bravery. Even at the age of 13, he survived an assassination attempt and emerged victorious. His bravery was further proved during battles against Afghan rulers, earning him recognition and respect. Let's dive into some of the remarkable military achievements that expanded the Sikh Empire. In 1798, he employed strategic tactics allowing the Afghan army to enter Lahore only to encircle and defeat them. Lahore became the first major conquest and Ranjit Singh's influence extended northwest towards Afghanistan. Over time, Ranjit Singh's forces continued to expand the empire's borders. He captured Multan in 1818 and through successful battles conquered the Badi Dwab and eventually parts of Kashmir, stretching his rule into the Himalayan foothills. The Sikh Empire, also known as the Sikh Raj and Sarkari Khalsa, fostered a rich cultural and religious environment. Despite the majority Sikh population, Muslims and Hindus constituted a significant part of the empire. Ranjit Singh's rule saw the promotion of cow veneration and the construction of many religious temples and buildings. Unfortunately, after Ranjit Singh's death, the Sikh empire faced internal conflict and external threats. The British East India Company capitalised on these divisions, leading to two Anglo-Sikh wars, with the Second War effectively ending the Sikh empire. In the 1830s, Maharaja Ranjit Singh's health began to deteriorate. Historical records suggest that he suffered from several health complications, including a stroke due to alcohol consumption and a failing liver. These challenges paved the way for the decline of the empire that he had built. Despite the fall of the Sikh empire, Maharaja Ranjit Singh's legacy still lives on. His contributions to Sikh culture military strategy and the preserving of religious diversity continue to inspire generations. Now, let's talk about some of the memorials and museums that were built in remembrance of the legendary Sikh Emperor. 
On the 20th of August 2003, a 22-foot tall bronze statue of Maharaja Ranjit Singh was installed. There is also a museum at Ram Bagh Palace in Amritsar. This museum contains objects related to Maharaja Ranjit Singh such as arms and armour, paintings, coins and jewellery. On the 27th of June 2019, to celebrate the Maharaja's 180th death anniversary, a 9 feet bronze statue of the Maharaja was unveiled at the Haveli Maharani Jindan. Throughout his reign, he constructed and reconstructed many Sikh temples, his most famous construction being the expansion and restoration of the Harmandal Sahib. Perhaps Maharaja Ranjit Singh's most lasting legacy was the restoration and expansion of the Harmandal Sahib, which is also known as the Golden Temple. The Golden Temple is the most admired temple of the Sikhs. He also directed the construction of Takat Shri Patna Sahib and Takat Shri Hazul Sahib. And that brings us to the end of our journey through the captivating life and reign of Maharaja Ranjit Singh, from the rise to his eventual decline. Shri Punjab's story reminds us of the complexities and achievements that he made to shape Sikh history. Join us next time as we explore another intriguing chapter of history. Before the video ends, like, share and subscribe to our channel for more exciting historical content.